Let's wake everyone up really quick. West Hollywood, where you at? I West love West you. Hollywood. Woo! Well, even the fat guy just did. <laughs> Look at this man over here. He's asking his wife, did that guy half-ass steroids or something? <laughs> It's like he went to the gym and then discovered cake. <laughs> well, like she said, my name is Roger. I'm originally from Yonkers, New York. That's right, the East Coast. Yeah. 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 Ow! Yeah. Who are you guys? Who invited you guys? <laughs> but uh, I know a lot of you are trying to decipher what is my nationality right now because I look fucked up. But <laughs> to clear things up, I am Hispanic Dominican. That's right. Which means I'm probably not wearing any socks right now. <laughs> I get my tough exterior from my mother. I also get my ability to dance from my mother. Yeah. From my mom, I also get my ability to grow a mustache. <laughs> See a lot of Asian women in the crowd. A lot of Asian women. Love them. Specifically, Chinese Asian women. I used to sleep with a lot of Chinese Asian women. Slept with a lot of them. Not Asian, I'm serious. Slept with a lot of them. Problem was, after an hour, I'd be horny. <laughs> no, but I'm um, serious, guys. Listen, the Asian community did wonders for me in college. They, they, they really did. You know, kids used to get caught up, uh, caught up in all kinds of gimmicks. You know, for exams, they had all kinds of cheat sheets, cell phones, all kinds of stuff. But the Asians. Asians on my fucking back. <laughs> and write this one down. I'll give you a secret that they gave me. This has been passed on for generations and generations. Asians told me, if you want to cheat on an exam, all you have to do is remember everything in your head. Really fucking hammered, really, really drunk, come back to my dorm and speak to the Star Wars kids. <laughs> Blew my mind, Dominican like me, Star Wars kids, specifically the Australian kids. They are really into it. Um, they told me once that Jedi is an official religion in Australia. 70,000 followers. I, w I can't make this up. <laughs> 70,000 followers couldn't make it up. The one thing that I thought was specifically uh, impressive was their uncanny ability to stay celibate. I didn't know how that <laughs> 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 Good for them. <laughs> but uh, guys, uh, I found out the other day I'm a huge fan of awkward situations. I really am. <laughs> I don't know what it does to me, but it really is a truly like crazy human emotion. Awkwardness. Which is why I wait till I'm with my gay cousin Angel to buy condoms. <laughs> now the reason it's so awkward, Angel's about Angel's about this big. He weighs 120 pounds, soaking wet with grits in his pants. <laughs> and of course, I'm shaped like Schwarzenegger's fat brother, <laughs> Dominican brother. <laughs> and let me assure you, Angel's not one of these conservative gays. Mm -mm. You can spot him a mile away. He is here, and he is queer. <laughs> <laughs> Which is why it's funny. Hanging out with this dude. But if you add condoms to any list, it's bound to make shit off. Right? It, it, it just is. You gotta spot it up correctly, though. You wait till the old lady at the check register. It's usually an old lady. That's how it always works. Me and Angel. She's counting things up. Let's see here. I got some duct tape. <laughs> A trumpet. <laughs> A double disc set of Kenny G's greatest hits. <laughs> 39 bananas? <laughs> and condoms? <laughs> at that point, she'll look at me and I'll be behind Angel doing this. <laughs> she'll look at Angel like, what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> Angel will give her the old eyebrow wiggle. <laughs> No, seriously, uh -huh. what are you two uh -huh. doing tonight? Yeah. If you get 40 bananas instead of 39, you get a 50 cent discount. Idiots. <laughs> Crazy old ladies. Guys, I got some good news for you this weekend. Nail the porn star. That's right. Woo! Nail the porn star. Porn star status right now. Nice. 
It was like throwing a fucking hot dog down a hallway. I guess my butthole was just too big. <laughs> I know I made a few gay jokes, and uh, my boy Mike made a few gay jokes earlier, and uh, we're all in the same group, but listen, guys, I can assure you, I'm not gay, all right? Far from it. And if you guys don't believe me, ask the 19 guys I've experimented with in college. <laughs> They'll let you know I fucked up. You know? <laughs> but seriously, uh, started dating again, feeling good, feeling great. Started dating left and right, dating day and night, just until my wife. <laughs> I'm just kidding, ladies, I don't have a wife. I can't even spell wife. Wife. L-I-F-E-O-V-E-R. Wife. <laughs> you like I have to close my eyes and spell life over, I guess. I'm tired of it. But seriously, this marriage thing, it's, uh, it, it, it's one that dates back for thousands of years that has a lot of just baggage and, and a lot of pressure behind it. Dates back thousands of years. You know, Cleopatra married two of her brothers. I'm serious. Two of her brothers. She must have lived in the Alabama part of Egypt. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, I know um, potheads, marijuana smokers, are known for their bad uh, memories. They have terrible memories. But I think, I think, alcoholics are far fucking worse. Seriously, I'll tell you why. One time, me and my friends, we. <laughs> I'm not going to